we're live. Hey. Hey everyone. Uh, hey, I, I, I titled this video uh, version 3 because I was at my office today uh, trying to do the this over LTE and for some reason it wouldn't do it and I normally do it over LTE and I don't, actually don't have um, a Wi-Fi in my office yeah. right now. This is my new home office in our new home and that's one of the reasons why uh, I haven't been posting a lot of videos uh, recently because everything we've been moving yeah. um, and as you guys know my dad's been having some health problems so we've been dealing with that and I think eventually I'm gonna be moving my office here so this is pretty cool so you guys know him he's my son Aiden he goes to uh, his uh, oh, he's got his school, his, his, his school his new school so anyway yeah we have a, a new box and we're gonna uh, unbox it in just a second here but um, um, I thought I would uh, apologize to you plane guys that are totally not into cars or drifting because we've I've been posting a lot of drifting mm -hmm. videos lately but drifting um, is a nice thing for me because um, they stay open super late so I can go there at 8 o'clock at night while these guys are sleeping and stay there till 4 in the morning or 2 in the morning yeah. or whatever like I normally do. I went there. Yeah we, I, he just took him to the drift track he really liked it a lot. and Did um, open it up? Um, I don't know what you think. So anyway guys, this came from Bagot. Uh, once the video is ended here, I'll go ahead and put a link down in the description below. But this, um, yeah, go ahead and start opening it. This is a box from Banggood. It got a little banged up, so we'll see if there's any damage in the inside. Probably not, but we shall see. Uh, but this one was made by Sonic Model, and this is just the kit. It was, I think it was on sale for like, oh, like $40 or something like that. I'll have to recheck. But anyway, uh, this is uh, closed really good with like those heavy duty staples. Oh, uh, in here and there. Okay, okay. So please be careful. Um, so I've always liked this model. It's uh, it's it's also made by um, Ready Made RC uh, RMRC, uh, which is also called the Mako, I believe. I think my wife is home, so we might get some more people coming in the the, the room here. Yeah, it looks like the FedEx guy might have had had a, a bit of a, a field day with it. So. And there's my dog. So Aiden's uh, furious at opening up the box, but like I was saying, guys, the, the the drift part of it is really nice because it doesn't take away from my family time. Family time for me is on the weekend, and uh, uh, so I can go there on a Friday night and just um, and really uh, take care of that. Here it so, comes. Hang on one second, guys. Live live video. I'm gonna open up the front door. You guys, live video. All right. I'm doing, a, I'm doing a live uh, unboxing right now, so if you guys want to come I in and say hi, it. you want to do it, Marco? Okay, come on in, come on in. <laughs> Family life. All right, so my daughter is gonna come in and, and say hi. So I'm gonna back this up just a little bit. We have the kids. Wait, 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 wait. In. Wait, wait. We're we're in the middle of it right now. Come, come here, Marco. Say hi. Hi. All right. Okay, so Marco, what do you see here? Is it a building of a plane? It's an airplane. So let's take out the sticker. Where you, you take out the next parts here. Can you grab the wing? Ooh. Mommy, want to say hi to the people at home? Oh, we, have sure. ten, we have 10 people watching live right now. Yeah. Hey. 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 <laughs> I was telling everyone how you know I haven't been posting a lot because we've been moving. How about, and, can people, I open what it? about the, one of the oh, most important they, family members? Oh, jeez. <laughs> the most important oh, man. family member. I'm right getting here. invaded. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Dad, your video has been taken over. <laughs> I know, I've been taken over by the, the 7 Demo 7 family, that's right. So, Michael, what, do you, what did you have right there? Can you show people what, the, what that is this right there? This is a wing, I think. This is a wing, I think, yes. That's a wing, Margaret. Here, take this wing out of this bag. And no, no, this wing out of this bag. I opened the end there. And um, I'm going to back this up just a little bit, guys. Back it up. Uh, back it up. All right. And we'll, we'll maybe just we'll snap this together if there's any spars in there. Aiden, check it out. Um, it doesn't look like there's spars in here. It is a wing, and I will um, guys, I will uh, scroll through your um, your comments in just a moment. So if you have any questions, post yeah, them up there. There's some weights in here. There's a, some lights. There's some screws. Screws, yeah. Screws and lights. All right, so weights and so oh, some weights. Okay, so guys, it does come with some stickers. And like I said, this this was on sale, and this is one of the reasons why I bought it. And I know I haven't like featured a, a airplane on my channel in a while, so let's see. It's... Dead, and it looks pretty much snap on. Yeah. Snap, like snap together. Snap together. Okay. Well, Aiden, take all those parts snap out of there. Parts. And can you look in the inside? Oh, here's some. Here's a spar. So we need the spar to kind of put together. And it looks like, like I said, guys. Um, this. I think the wings will 
So this is why it's called the Mako. If you can see the front of it, it what does it look like, Margo? A shark. A shark, exactly. Wait, it's there are two fronts then. Yeah, it gives you. They give you two nostrils or two two mo uh, two noses. <laughs> I hope you guys are enjoying this. <laughs> so here's some more uh, stickers. All right, Aiden. Um, yeah, bring this over. Aiden, bring the fuselage over in front of the camera so that we can actually see it. Wait. And it comes with another top. Well, this is oh, the this. And here's the box. Okay, so guys, this is the main fuselage. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna put this uh, hatch on Where does here. This go? Uh, those are gonna be like some on the bottom of the body. So it looks like there's a little thing this for a camera. Right All right, wait, wait, okay. guys. So. I think this goes right here. Check it down. Wait, we got a user's manual. User's manual. Okay, wait. Oh wait. yeah. Okay, wait, Michael. That cool. one goes. Um, sh can like, you show you the can, people what it looks you, like? You can put a dome on the front. Yeah, yeah. Can you show the people what that looks like? A little closer. A really hold it so that they can see. Um, this is. What uh -huh. It is. Uh -huh. Dome. Okay, that I got yeah. the dome right here. Can I? Can you slide it on? Can you slide it on? I'll hold it over here. We have a dome oh, right uh, here, folks. Yeah. And Dad, two tiny screws for the dome. These okay. are important. Okay. Oh, whoa, no. man, it's just falling apart. Okay, so, um, Margo, can, can you grab the other wing real quick? Yeah. Okay, all right. All right, we won't worry about the hatch. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ah. It's a dome. It's a dome. Hang on, love. Let's, uh, let's get this together. Okay, let's slide that on. Mm -hmm. I kind of need to hold it so uh, because um, okay. I need to put it all together here. Okay, so Aiden, uh, let's and let's get the no. One, let's get grab one of the nose cones, you guys. Nose cones. No, 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 that's not the nose. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Okay. I think there's two uh, winglets that go in here as well. Yeah, winglets. So, so uh, yeah, I'm not gonna push right this all the way together, but let's put the nose cone. Yeah, the on. winglets are right here. Whoa, that thing's slippery. It gives, it they is. give you two new nose cones, yeah, actually. Yeah, they do. It's kind of oh, cool. Dad, we, um, we, Dad, we can each be a shark. <laughs> uh, Dad, we mentioned that earlier. Okay, so that's what it looks like there. Um, I'm going to kind of hold this together and turn it around. Oh. <laughs> it does not hold bad. together. All right, yeah, so so we're going to have to put this... Six out. people are watching, Dad, and we have four likes. We have four likes. And <gasps> I'm right. going to get my food. Yeah. Mom. Aiden, you need to do your homework, buddy. <laughs> I landed, I know. <laughs> All right, Mario, come over here. Okay, so um, so this is the Sonic model uh, HD wing, and like it does come with a, a different nose cone thing, which is a dome, so you can put a GoPro in it. Um, one of the reasons I, I wanted to get this airplane is because it looks really efficient. Like it'll it'll really slip through the air very easily, and it looks like it's gonna handle really well. And I've actually seen a few of these. I actually have seen a few of these um, flying before, and they, they look like they do a really good job. They remind me of the uh, Hobby King. Um, what is it called? The uh, the Discovery, the Go Discover. Excuse me. So. This looks like it'll go together, together pretty easy. Um, it looks like the foam is uh, is really nice. Uh, what do you guys think of this foam? It's actually nice. It is nice. It's very nice and smooth here. Mm, burrito, you know, we just got some El Pollo Loco we're going we're gonna to do. So uh, I do also, I like the fact that the servo pockets are on the top of the wing so that they're not on the bottom of the wing so they'll, 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 they won't get damaged, in, in other words. So, um, so it's just um, standard wing, uh, Elevons, um, Aiden. One. <laughs> I think Aiden just stepped on my wing. <laughs> I, I don't think it's damaged. It's not, it's not damaged, Margo? No, okay, um, anything else? Yeah, it's fine. Uh, guys, let's take a look at the hardware real quick. Um, so here are my vertical stabs here, the st st stabilizers. And let's take a look at the hardware. So th there's these little um, plastic. It's called hardware. It's it's called pla pla uh, well, I'm not going to actually take them out, Margo, but they're... It looks like there's a lot of magnets here uh, for keeping everything together, uh, the, the hatches and everything. Um, and the hardware actually looks pretty nice. It has the screw through um, uh, horn, the Elevon horns uh, that uh, actually screw through. Uh, okay, so let me take a look at your guys' comments. Um, and there's also, it looks like this is uh, to help with the, the glass dome. So this kind of goes on like this. 
and then the dome will fit in the, the front of it there, so. Okay, so let me just look through you guys' comments. If you, have, you guys have any questions about me, my channel, what's going on, um, just just let me know and I'll, I'll answer those. Drop as, a comment. As Drop a comment, I know. All right, so let's take a quick peek here at you guys' comments. It says, from Two Monsters, it says, Hello, Demo. Looks like the FedEx delivered. Uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, Mark M, long time, I know. It's been a while. So, um, like I said, been busy with moving and everything. FedEx always destroys my packages, Two Monsters. Hello, Demo from Gilder Alexandre. Alexander. Uh, Mark L M, hello family, awesome family from Michael Wiener. Thank you. Realtor, cool. Oh yeah, I, I know you. I've talked to you before. Um, send the link to us. Yes, once I finish this video, I'll produce a link uh, through Banggood. And of course, if you click on that link, it, it supports my channel. And these children will not have to go hungry. <laughs> <laughs> there are no more burritos. Um, what is the name of the wing? It is called the Sonic Model. Uh, Margo, can you grab that again for me? The Sonic Mako. Well, it is called the Mako. If you get this from Ready Made RC, it's called the Mako. Uh, Marco, uh, the instruction booklet. Thank you. Um, two monsters. Oops. <laughs> Mark M landed. Yes. Uh, <laughs> burrito. Uh, horseship. <laughs> horseship. That's a funny name. <laughs> I. I have that wing and it's great. Uh, um, I can get close to 40 minutes of flight time. Horseship. Um, what size battery do you use in the airplane? Is it just a standard 2200? Or is it um, like a 3300, something like that? And is it um, is it 4S or 3S? I'm guessing probably like 3S. Ricardo Burton says, watching from Trinidad in the Caribbean. All right, hey guys, how's it going? Okay, so like I said, if you get this from Ready Made RC, it's called the uh, RMRC, the, um, the Mako, because it does look like a little bit of a shark in the front. But this is called the, um, the Sonic Model HD Wing, and when I bought this, it was on sale, and this is just the kit, so. I'm gonna supply the motor, and I'm gonna make this like a really efficient, um, oh, thanks for that horseship, it is a 4S4000. So I'm gonna make this like a real efficient, um, just cruiser for a kite hill, um, and it should be pretty nice um, to fly there, I'm guessing, because like I said, I love the Go Discover. it floats and floats and floats when you try and land it, which is kind of fun to, to deal with, um, but it has a really nice flight envelope, so. Anyway, it has uh, directions as far as the CG bump goes there, and I can always, one of the things I always do is I always go on to uh, RC groups just to let um, hey, Dad. people know, just to just kind of figure out more information about the plane. Because a lot of times when uh, you have a stated CG in the manual, a lot of times they're wrong because it's just put there by the engineers and they're estimating where it should go. And a lot of times they don't test that. So um, anyway, guys, I'm gonna keep, <laughs> I was gonna say I was gonna keep this short, but it's already at 12 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and end that, and we'll see. Hey, uh, Dad, would yes. you? Tell them maybe what we're doing in the next video, like um, a, a sneak peek or something. Um, what is going on in the next video? Do you know that, or should I? Are you, want, are you asking me to tell them? I'm asking you to tell them. Um, well, things coming up. Um, there's some more drift stuff coming up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna making, I'm gonna be making a video about um, the difference between four wheel, four wheel drive drift, four wheel drive counter steer, and rear wheel drive. And and I didn't know all this stuff before I started into drifting, and there's a lot to know. And there's a lot to know about setup and weights and all that stuff. And I'm just learning all this we myself. the other thing with Banggood. What about the other thing with Banggood? The, the, the list. The list? The list video. Oh, well, uh, that'll be a surprise. So we, we're going to have a kind of a funny video coming up, which is really cool. Uh, and Horseship says the CG is correct on the plane. That's good to know. Uh, see, I'm already gaining information from you guys. Um, so... Um, if you guys have ever explored Banggood, you know there are some wonderful and weird products uh, that are, you find on there. And so I'm going to be producing a video uh, called The Strangest Things Found on, on Banggood. Now, we're not going to delve into the adult section because I do want to keep my, my channel um, kid friendly. <laughs> but there is some mighty weird things that you can find on Banggood. Just random, random stuff. So I thought that would be a funny video and I will... Um, actually, I took all the screenshots yesterday. And um, uh, so I should be ready to produce that video. I'm doing a, vo a voiceover uh, tonight. And like I said, this is my new studio. Um, here's the computer I do all my editing on. Uh, and this is my new office. So let me just take this off here real quick. So we'll kind of show you here. So this is our new office room here. It's, just, it's very unfinished right now. We have our piano there, some of our guitars over there, and my mic stand for when I do uh, that type of stuff. And uh, 
I am going to um, to to go ahead and end the video now here right now. Um, but I am gonna take a quick peek at your guys' comments to see if there's any new ones in there. I'm gonna put you. You get in that trifle. You get in there. Let's see. Let's take a quick peek here. Yes, it's in there. Um, do you have any monster truck RCs? Two monsters. Uh, I don't have any monster trucks, but I have a super fast. Uh, Traxxas, Traxxas Slash that I've modified and it goes probably 40, 45 miles an hour. It's so fast that when I gun it and I go full speed, on just on 2S, um, it'll go about, uh, as it's approaching 40, if it hits a little pebble, it'll kick the front end up and it'll launch into the air upside down and backwards and it slides backwards on its roof for about 50 feet. <laughs> and we might be selling it. We might be selling it because Aiden wants a drift car, so we'll see. We'll and see about that. The, yeah, the, the funny thing about the Traxxas is the XX looked like um, H's, and my son always said, hey, can we drive the Traha today? <laughs> and so it for, it's forever been known as the Traha, so, which is really funny. All right. Okay, let's see here. I have a Lozy uh, 10 MT on 3S. 3S is crazy. I don't know how you even control that. I actually added a um, a gyro to the uh, Traxxas, and it really it really um, helps it straight line stability and when it, when it's driving and everything. So it really takes out a lot of the uh, the craziness to it. So what I'm going to do also is I'm actually going to shorten the length of the shocks to bring the center of gravity down, even though I have the low center of gravity frame with it. Um, that'll it'll make it more on road friendly. I also added road tires to the Traxxas, and it makes it a lot more fun. So. All right, guys, uh, take it easy. Margo, please. <laughs> Margo, can you say bye? Bye. Bye, guys. Um, thank you for joining me and my family. Um, more stuff to come as soon as we get settled here in the house uh, and uh, life gets a little uncrazier. Mm -hmm. All right? Draw. Draw. Bye, guys. Bye.